Hey everybody, thanks for joining me on Stars Touch Heartfelt Healing. Happy birthday to my granddaughter Riley today. She's six. I'm so proud of you, Riley. So um, I have an angel guide message today. Take charge and take action. Here we go. Don't be afraid to take charge or be strong at this time. Sometimes we have to take control in order to be respected and honored. If you feel that your current situation is moving in a direction that isn't serving you, your joy, or your purpose, this message is to put your foot down. You don't have to be aggressive, but you do need clarity now. And unless you step in, it won't unfold. So set up a good example. Respect yourself. Lead rather than be led. If you're wondering whether to make the next move in a particular situation, this card encourages you to do so. Often angels find it difficult to support us fully unless we make the first move. Meet them halfway now by showing commitment to moving forward. It's so true. Um, pretty much when you're wanting to bring something into your life, we can write it down, we can talk about it out loud and do all those types of things. But if we do a little tiny step towards it, whatever it might be, just one little thing each day kind of gives God and our angels a little idea of what we want to bring in, and then they can also help and assist. Extended message, if you're feeling ambitious at this time, this card is asking you to trust in your gifts and potential. You have the opportunity to move forward in your career, personal life, and spiritual life. You are a co-creator with the universe, and your angel's guide is encouraging you to take action. By setting clear intentions, having a strong vision, and taking the action steps you need to make your ideas come to life, you are showing the universe your commitment to expansion. Know that with every step you take, your angels are with you, cheerleading and encouraging you to rise up and focus on your intention and set it out like an arrow. What a wonderful action card. So we have the sun in Virgo and we have the moon in Sagittarius today, and that's a fire sign. So that's going to get us going a little bit. Uh, the other thing, too, is I did do a video at the dam yesterday for the thyroid healing. It's the throat chakra opening, self-expression. It can bring in all kinds of things that are wonderful, um, different things that you can eat. I wrote it down in the description box below that helps keep that throat chakra open. So I did add music to it. I noticed there was a few people that already watched it before I had the music on there. If you want to go back in and take a look, but I'll... Put that on at the end of this video so that you can click on it if you'd like to go ahead and meditate and really work on that throat chakra today and that can really help you as far as doing these action steps towards whatever it is you want to bring in so i hope you have a wonderful saturday we're going to end this with a heaven and earth just reaching for the sky and the ground breathing in and release breathing in and release and heaven rushing in, just bringing in whatever it is you want to manifest today. Bringing it right into your heart. Thank you so much for watching. I'm so proud of you, Riley. Happy birthday again. I love you.